why do the artists matter? Why do art, why does art and why do artists matter so much? This is a fascinating question. It's a gripping question for me because I actually define myself, if I can define myself as anything, as an artist. Because entrepreneur, leader, speaker, musician, you know, all these other terms don't really cover it. You know, shout out to Adam Roa. The true way I believe to live life is as a work of art. Can you live life as if you were a work of art? And why is this important? The artist's sacred duty in all human culture for all time, as far as I've studied and know, is to awaken. It's to awaken the imagination of their tribe, of their society. This is the duty of the artists. If the artist cannot find a way into a future that is more beneficial for our land, our children, and our people, then who can? The politician, the CEO, the theologian, the priest, these stations in the tribe and in the community are not sufficient to offer us a guiding vision. And if you need evidence for that, merely open a new tab right now on your device and look at the news. There's no image of the future that is uplifting and inspiring and incorporates the full paradigm of the human experience and the human being out there. So that, therefore the artists have to step up. And this is a call to myself. I'm talking to myself right now and anyone else that's resonating with this, like toss me, toss me the fist emoji in the comments. What part of you wants to live through as art? I think it was Picasso who said, all children are born creative, all children born artists. It's just education, their parents, their family, the society conditions that out of them and puts them into a little box up here on one side, at a desk, or in a form of labor that really resembles a machine. And the artist and the art that is produced from such a creature does not fit into a machine. It's actually an organic system of interrelated and interdependent pieces that form something more powerful than the sum of its parts. So are you an artist? I wanna know. Are you an artist? Are you here to inspire and create? Are you here to paint a vision of a new world? Because this is the news I've received, especially in the last month, really, at a lot of deep inner work and a lot of like depression and uncertainty and confusion that was created in my mind and in my life. And I saw that really there's only two ways forward. I can either paint my own narrative and create the future I want to dwell in, or I can surrender to past programs and continue the repetitive cycle of samsara. I can keep the karmic wheel going as it were, which is just something not ultra spiritual, but the summation and repetition of habits and patterns. And this is what we're trying to escape from in history and transcend. We don't want to act out the past again. We can't act out another 20th century and survive. We can't have another world war. It, it won't work that way. Therefore, as artists, we have to paint, create, draw, sing, dance, express, and build communities of the future. Because I got news for you, brothers and sisters. Thank you everyone for joining. Give me a shout out where you're tuning in from. If you do not feel at home, if you do not feel at peace with your reality and with your existence and your society, your friends, guess what? You were sent here, you came here in a body to create the new vision, the new paradigm. You didn't come here to stay stuck. You didn't come here to wait for retirement in a 401k and then paint and then draw and then write. In a sacred society of the future, the one I hold in my heart, the vision I'm holding for the future, incorporates science and art. It incorporates work and play and it incorporates spirituality and the material together. And children can be raised this way to not stifle their inner artist, their inner creativity, their inner fucking weirdness and radical expression that wants to come out. It's actually on you and on me 
our programs and our limitations that we would even stifle their expression. They are the most updated version of the DNA code. They are the newest models in a long three billion year chain of beautiful organic life that has stepped into this physical reality on this planet and created with the greatest artist there is, which is source, which is nature, which is father sky, mother earth. When you work with your inner energy in this rawest primal way, and this is what the artist does, and I know that because I'm an artist. When I work with that deep emotion and that, that sediment, that manure, that power, and I speak it, or I draw it, or I paint it, or I dance it, or I breathe it, I'm creating a cycle of dialogue with the universe. And most of all, my own soul. But the beauty of art is that we can share it and we get to inspire people with it. We get to activate people with it. We get to give people something new, a new way to express themselves, a new way to express reality. And so if you can do this, awaken, become an artist, step into it now. We don't have time to wait. If you're digging this, tag someone in the comments that needs to hear this message and share this video. Love you guys. Happy solar eclipse, new moon. Plant strong seeds, strong rituals. Until next time.